Hi there. Uh, you have purchased our vodka infusion kit, which means that you get to spend the next few minutes with me. I'm going to show you how we're going to make the red ruby slippers using the stuff that you have at your disposal. Okay, so first thing we're going to do is we're going to take uh, one of our botanical jars with our vanilla pod in there. Okay, we're going to lay this out flat. We're going to take a sharp knife and very safely, minding your fingers, we're going to try and cut this in half. The reason we want to cut this in half is because we're going to be leaving this to infuse for quite some time. A lot of the flavor of the vanilla is actually inside the pod itself. So once you've got that in half, pop the other one away. Pop the lid back on for another time. Then take your bottle and just pop the vanilla pod in there like that. That's the first bit done. Uh, next, you're gonna take your powdered raspberry. Now, we've actually put enough in here for two infusions. Uh, so there's about six grams in here. Grab your funnel and we're gonna need half of that. Now the next thing you're gonna do is you're gonna take a clean tasting vodka so that it's ready to receive these flavors. Okay, grab your vodka, pop it in there. And pretty much instantly you're gonna see that beautiful red color from the raspberry. Pop the lid on the top, give it a very quick shake so that it's gone all throughout there. Label it. And now you're gonna leave this for about 48 hours to fully infuse. Okay, so after you've had this uh, infusing for two days, your spirit is gonna be nice and flavored with the raspberry and vanilla that we've already put in there. Um, so I'm gonna grab this now and you're gonna to need to filter it out because obviously we've still got all of these things in there. So there should be a filter included in your packet as well as a funnel. What we're gonna do is just gonna pour this through the filter into your jug. So once you get to the end of your straining process, you're gonna have quite a lot of raspberry powder left in there along with your vanilla pod. And basically what you wanna do is take this coffee filter away and just discard that. Once you've filtered your spirit through, you're gonna to need to clean the bottle because you're still gonna have a lot of residue in there. So give this a good thorough rinse through. Once you've given your bottle a proper rinse through, all you're gonna to need to do then is find your funnel and pour your infused spirit back in. And there you go, you've got a lovely, nice vanilla and raspberry infused vodka. Next thing we're gonna do with this is make ourselves a cocktail. Okay, so you've made it this far. Good job, you. The last bit we're gonna do here is the actual making of our cocktail. So this is the exciting part. You wanna take your cocktail glass that you're gonna be making this in, chill it down, so pop some ice in there, and this is just water, just to make sure you get that conductivity around the glass. All right, the next thing you are gonna to want to do is take 10 mils of red wine. So this is just, just under halfway in your jigger. 25 mils of sugar syrup, so this is all the way to the top. Give you a small jigger. And 20 mils of lemon juice. Last of all, of course, your 50 mils of infused spirit. Now this should provide you with a nice, fully rounded, balanced cocktail. Next, you're gonna take your little jar of food glitter. Now you're only gonna need a small amount for this. Um, we're recommending about a quarter of a teaspoon. All right, just take that, put it in the bottom of your glass there. Now you're gonna add some ice to your cocktail. Give it a shake. Break this open, push your finger against the side and hit it. Easy as that. I'm sure you'll do it first time. If you don't have a cocktail shaker at home, don't worry, you can just use a jar or just any kind of large container that you can seal and shake properly. Next, you're gonna need a strainer and a fine strainer. And just empty the drink 
into your glass. Now, not only is this drink a delicious mix of raspberry and vanilla, but when you agitate it like this, you can see all the beautiful swirls inside made by the glitter. And this is the Red Ruby Slippers. Enjoy.